Good afternoon. How y'all doing on this beautiful day? Yeah, the day the Lord gave y'all to do what you want to do with. Hopefully it's something good, not something stupid. I need to talk to y'all right quick, man. We stuck on stupid in this country. Seriously. We all hating each other. We all not living the way God planned for us to live. We doing what we want to do when we want to do it. Not people running around here talking about, oh, Uncle done made it. He out there on that Can-Am living in California, living the high life. He done made it now, y'all. Look at him out there living large. Man, let me tell y'all something. I made it years ago, you understand? I made it when I decided to start working for the man above. That's when I made it. When I decided to start feeding his people, homeless people on the street, that's when I made it. Yeah, I had a, a video that went viral on Katrina, and I got many videos. I mean, I'm, I'm a music artist. I'm a rap artist, supposedly. Whatever God got for me to do, that's what I do. So he blew me up as a rap artist, and he's blowing me up all over this world so I can make a message to y'all. It's time for a change. It's time for each and every one of us as an individual person on this earth to wake up and realize that we are living the lives mankind wants us to live. That's not the kind of lives God wanted us to live. God wanted us to be happy. He wanted us to love each other. He wanted to share whatever he blessed us with, with other people. And we're not doing that right now. What we're doing is when we get blessings, we, we run home and, and stash these blessings in the closet and in a safe spot so nobody else can't get to them or touch them. That's wrong. It's stupid. Y'all got to wake up, man. Life's about sharing love, sharing what God blesses you with. These preachers out there playing games with y'all, talking about if you uh, deposit this in my account, God's going to bless you in so many days. Y'all so, they're so full of shit and y'all falling for it. That's on y'all, man. I changed my life. I know what God wants us to do. I suggest y'all do the same thing. Find love in your heart. Speak to everybody. And it's crazy because we don't even speak to our own people. So how am I asking you to speak to people that are not of your race or your ethnicity? Because that's breaking the barriers of hate, man. When you walk past a, a, a white person and don't speak or a Mexican and don't speak or... Uh, Anybody and don't speak you are not sharing the love that God put in your heart You are not you are sharing the hate that mankind has in your mind Because you're afraid this person might not speak back or you're afraid of whatever this person might say Step up man. Do like God tell you. I'm telling you speak to everybody. Stop the fucking bullshit Be a gangster. I tell everybody good morning people look at me like I'm crazy. I don't give a shit I care about him. This is who I care about. That's who y'all need to start caring about. Look at this beautiful view I'm living in Cali. I'm living very large, man. And I'm steadily doing God's work. I'm steadily doing what my man has for me to do. If God wants me to do rap, I'm going to do rap. I never was listening. I never listened to a lot of rap as a youngster. But now I'm in the rap. I have to do what I have to do. I need y'all to wake the fuck up before this war starts. Realize that they are planting this seed in y'all mind that everything is negative. Everything is hate. Everything is violence. Y'all retweeting all the wrong shit. Y'all resharing all the wrong shit. You're sharing hate, man. You're supporting the system that you're supposed to be fighting against. You're a part of the problem. You are a part of the problem. You're retweeting and sharing stupid shit. Wake up, man. Stop the dumb shit. Y'all fucking open y'all eyes up. They're playing y'all like fucking checkers in a checkerboard game, man. Fuck. It's your move, all right? Make the fucking right move, man. Make a positive move. Man, y'all just don't know. Lord, every day I get blessed. Every day I wake up, I got blessings coming. Not materialistic shit. People that I love, people that I'm sharing love with on this internet site that I'm talking to. That's, the, that's what I'm sharing, love. And that's where my blessings come from, the love of other people, man. When I talk to y'all and I share this gift of love with y'all, that's where I'm getting rich at. Not in a financial way. I want to shout out and thank the people that blessed me through Hurricane Katrina, the Ruggiero family, and also Mr. Tony Bennett. These people gave me the insight to see what a, a philanthropist was. A per, a, 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 man, I'm so illiterate, I can't. <laughs> but they are great, great people. They are, uh, y'all know the word I'm talking about. The people, the people that give back, man. They blessed me to help me get through the Katrina misery that I was in. And they blessed so many other people. So all I can tell y'all is to change y'all ways. Start supporting other people. Start getting out and helping your family members and sharing love with everybody. Stop with this hate thing, man. Also, get your plans to vote now. Stop promoting and pushing this Bernie Sanders. Say it with me, Bernie Sanders. This is the only man that's gonna be able to save this country from a racial war. Trust me, he is the only one. And y'all up on the Northeast Coast, and y'all talking about there's no racism up there. This is America. If racism is in any part of America, it's wrong. 
it's wrong. And if you're on the East Coast, you're still a part of it. Because when this bitch blow, guess what? It ain't gonna happen in Mississippi and Louisiana. It's gonna happen all over the country. Because nobody's gonna know who to trust. Don't y'all understand the fucking game they're playing? You're not gonna know who the fuck to trust. Black, white, gray, green, orange, yellow, purple. You ain't gonna know who the fuck to trust when this war starts. And nobody's gonna win. We're all gonna lose. Even you rich motherfuckers that's making them millions of dollars. Y'all gonna lose too, man. Y'all gonna lose. Chris Brown, you ain't gonna be able to perform no fucking music nowhere if this war kick off. None of y'all. Justin Bieber, you ain't gonna be able to make the money you make. And none of y'all, all y'all money gonna be worthless, man. Come on, wake up. Let's stop this war before it starts. Spread this message. Tell everybody. We gotta get back to loving each other, man. It's fucked up. And we can fix it. Only us can fix it. I love y'all, man. Peace out. I'm getting on my baby right now. I'm going to enjoy some more life, man. I love that bike, man. You get a chance, get whatever you want in life, get it and love it. And share it. You understand? Share love. Share what God gave you. Y'all so selfish and my, my, me, me, my, my. Fuck. End it. Now. Change your ways. You can't change but that one person. I beg you. Start from within. Start speaking to everybody. Start feeding homeless people. Start getting ready for your day of death. It's coming. We are all going to die. It's how you die and how you live before you die. Get on board, man. Live right. Change your ways. I love all y'all, man. Peace out. Be safe. Love you. New Orleans. Don't think I don't love y'all. I love y'all to death. Y'all my family. I can't get back there until I start seeing y'all ready to fight this challenge, man. We got to step up. We got to stop buying shit. We got to start spending our money. We got to start supporting our people. Wake up. Smell the roses. Let me go get my medication. I love y'all. Peace out. All my veteran brothers, stay strong, bro. Stay strong, because if I really do pop, I'm going to find some kind of way to help so many of y'all. It's pitiful. Same with my homeless, same with my people in New Orleans. The money I make don't need to go in my pocket, baby. I don't need that kind of paper. What I need to do is to help folks. So I got a lot of people I need to bless. And it's going to happen. I already know it. I meditate. God show me my path. I just got to stay faithful and stay strong. That's if they don't take me out first. And they being the 1%, the ones that's trying to start this war. And if they do, guess what? It's all good, baby. I'm going home to my daddy. Don't get no better than that. Later. Love y'all. Check out.